Yo, how's everybody doing? It's the Hawking Regime here, and today I'm coming at you guys with another Madden player creation tutorial video. Today we're doing Bryce Love of the Stanford Cardinal, one of the best running backs the college football world has seen in the 2017-2018 season. Ended up finishing second overall in the Heisman Trophy, weight, trophy race, only losing to Baker Mayfield of the Oklahoma Sooners. Had a pretty outstanding year, over 2,000 yards from scrimmage in 2017, almost 2,000 rushing yards. Uh, I, I'm, it's almost speechless just to look at this guy, these guys' uh, numbers, especially a guy like Bryce Love. But when you talk about the Stanford Cardinal running backs in, the his, in their recent history, Toby Gerhardt comes to mind, Stephon Taylor. They've had some good players, especially on the college level. It just seems like that transition to the next stage in professional football in the National Football League never quite seems to work out for these guys for whatever reason. I think in part it could be the fact that they play with the pretty great offensive line for most years you know they have some NFL prospects year in year out on that offensive line they recruit very well in that area and so I think they do get helped out a little bit there and being able to push some defenders around and create some more open lanes for Bryce Love and no doubt Bryce Love has a good offensive line but he's still productive in the running game and that's all you can ask out of a running back given with what you know he has to work with and rushing for almost 2,000 yards averaging over 8 yards a carry in 2017 uh, I, it, there's really nothing else you need to say. This guy is a standout player. And one of the mistakes I actually didn't make in this video was decreasing the speed of Bryce Love significantly more than I should have. I didn't realize how quick he was, and I, I don't know what I was looking at, but I think I'm giving him like 87 speed, 86 acceleration, 86 agility. That should be up to the high 80s, if not low 90s. So keep that in mind. I apologize for that going forward, but those mistakes tend to not happen too frequently when I do these just apologize for that one so Stanford actually had a pretty great year in 2017 in terms of record even with a guy dominating so much of the offensive production nine and four ended up losing to USC in the Pac-12 championship game can't be too mad at that USC is extraordinarily talented have one of the best quarterbacks in the nation and a very solid running game and Ronald Jones the second another candidate for a player creation tutorial video in the future but Bryce Love being such a huge part of the offense I think that sometimes does hurt Stanford the lack of balance, although they do run the football very well. Sometimes, like Wisconsin, I think they might get too sucked up in the running game, and then they're just not able to execute in big-time situations where they need to win. Wisconsin kind of felt like that a lot to me. I don't know if Stanford's as similar to that as Wisconsin, but they very much remind me of a team like that, where they just kind of get lulled into running the football too frequently, being a little bit too conservative, and not being able to make plays when they need to. And against a team like Ohio State and a team like USC, for Stanford, it kind of, I think, bit them in the end. But it was still close, to be honest, just like the Wisconsin-Ohio State game was. You know, still close game, uh, one possession for the most, you know. So it, it, you can't complain too much if you're a Stanford fan, but sometimes that's the, the problem with running the football so much. But don't tell Bryce Love that. You know, he's been so effective running the football for Stanford and has really been able to showcase his talent. So maybe he can be a consideration for a draft pick I don't know if he'll leave this year I would, I would assume he would leave for the 2018 NFL draft there's definitely been some rumors swirling around some certain players on not declaring I believe there was an article that released about Josh Rosen how Jim Moore was told by him or was kind of confident that he was actually not going to declare for the 2018 draft which is very shocking of course but you know these players definitely have an opportunity to make it in the next level Bryce Love is one of them and, you know, I would definitely take my chance if I was him, given the year he had. He's not going to have a better senior season than he did in his junior year, finishing second in the Heisman race. Almost had 2,000 rushing yards and over 2,000 all-purpose yards. Unbelievable year for Bryce Love. And, unfortunately, Baker Mayfield led, led his team to a college football playoff berth. And that, ultimately, I think, along with his great numbers, of course, led to him winning the Heisman Trophy. And... Another year where a Stanford player and McCaffrey, I don't even know how I forgot McCaffrey. Uh, so McCaffrey really has translated much better than any of the previous Stanford running backs that I've thought of as of late. And he's doing excellent on the NFL stage. He's really being utilized very well with the Carolina Panthers. But here we go with the ratings. And by the way, when it comes to the equipment, the clear visor, the double armbands in both elbows, the double wristbands, I believe that's just tape though. I don't think those are actual wristbands. And then some Nike glo gloves and Nike cleats. Uh, pretty authentically you know, created in my opinion. I don't think there's too many errors. I think that's pretty close. Of course, the Stanford Cardinal uniform 
um, is not available in the game. I actually probably will look to see if I can add the Stanford jer jersey uh, in the description just to show you guys what it looks like. Um, but the Cardinals actually of Arizona have a decent looking uniform that's relatively close to Stanford. So I had to put that one up there. But we get into the ratings. Good elusiveness, good agility, great ball carrier vision. The trucking is okay. He's a little bit of a smaller back, very speedy. And I did not make uh, that adjustment. I did not increase the speed as I should have. But again, that's something you guys can for, can for sure change on your own time. And I do apologize for that mistake. But I think other than that, it's all pretty close to how you would think Bryce Love would be in Madden NFL 19 or any Madden NFL video game in the future. But that will be the conclusion of the video. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. You know, Make sure to subscribe to the channel for more Madden NFL 18 content as well as player creation tutorial videos, franchise series, and hopefully some NBA 2K content in the future. Also, just launched a new website that is in the description along with the Facebook group page and Twitter. So... If you want to you know stay tuned for some updates on future players or want to suggest content for the future definitely hit up the website uh, lots of good stuff there for you guys along with my uh, video schedule but once again hopefully you guys enjoyed the video and yep thanks for watching